V is calling. Ergo, V as well. Need them to make contact with the Voodoo Boy's chief, if you can swing it. Ah, straight to biz. Ultra heavy variety. The Voodoo Boys, led by one Maman Brigitte. It's no easy feat getting an audience with her. Maman Brigitte? That a nickname? Spooky cold alias? Alas, I've not had the pleasure of asking her over tea. But no. Many assume otherwise, yet her title carries no religious weight. The voodoos don't adhere to their cultural heritage. Rather, they loosely allude to it. Hmm, yeah. Didn't expect you could swing this anyway. V? Reverse psychology? On me? Surely you're better than that. Really not doing biz with the voodoos? Surprised? I strive to avoid risking my dealings. They pose much of it. Still, feelers I can extend. No harm in asking around. I just need information from you. A springboard, if you will. Let's see, there's something I got that they want. You've got something for the VDBs. Trust me, they don't want it. They don't need it. An insular bunch all round. Tech, networks, what you will, all in-house. But if you insist, I'll poke around. In the event of a twitch, you'll hear from me. Heads open, drag the bodies inside. I told you, dog. Afterlife's all about rep. The respect you command. Badge don't mean a thing here. Doors are shut to us, that's that. Tough cookies and move on. Incredible. Just fucking incredible. Cunt rogue thinks she's above the law? Oh, man, quiet down. She hear that, she shoot your balls off. And I don't want to get hit by no ricochet. Hey. In you go. Hey, V. Good to see you. How's it going? Could definitely go for a drink. Tough day? Like any other. So, what'll it be?
Thanks, Claire. No problem. Just holler if you need anything. Chuma mine earned a spot on the menu here. A chulo bowl with the bun? Yeah, well, sorry to hear. Remember his drink? The recipe? Vodka on the rocks, lime juice, and ginger beer. <sighs> Splash of love. That's right. In the drink's name. A Jackie Wells. Right. Well, the first Jackie Wells is on me. Business booming, I hope. Seeing it yourself. Can't complain. Folks always get thirsty, and we're here when they do. How's the afterlife? Working here, I mean. No real complaints. Fights are rare, and when they do happen, they're over quick. Killer clientele, am I right? Your words, not mine. Again, solve your own problems. Clean up you your own shit. Up. Go fuck yourself. Hey, interested in some work? Doing what? A business opportunity. Cargo transport. Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? I'm listening. It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, then I tell you how to deliver it. Very straightforward. Mm -hmm. Everything except my pay. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. Imported and duty-free. Duty-free and detail-free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? Yeah, sure, I'm in. Good, I knew we'd find acceptable terms. Head to the Kabuki waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words, no future. Once you locate it, collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Mm hmm Till then, I guess. Rogue? Wanted to talk. It's okay. Hmm. Not here. Not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking rogue, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her, she's got MRI. See right through you. Give her the truth. The girl. What was her gripe? Why didn't you ask her? Might still be around, sniveling in a corner. Need your services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer, worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn, Jackie Wells. Multiple bells ringing, B. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. They knew the risks. All sorts of shit happens. To all sorts of people. Even to the best. To you too, Rogue. Our Sokka Tower. Remember? Who'd you lose back then? Johnny something? Ah, you came prepped. Of course. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm -hmm. See? Should be enough. Mm-hmm. Come back tomorrow. We'll talk.
here to see Rogue. Expecting me. Hey, Rogue, I'm back. What about Hellman? Two, please. Make some room. Sit down. I hope you found him. Don't see that often. Determination like yours. Must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Enjoy. To your health. To yours, kid. Gonna need it. Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. Think she'll help? The rogue I remember was one cold-ass bitch. But she usually went with her gut. Something tells me she thinks you check out. Let's see what you got. Your Hellman's not on any payroll, not officially anyway. But he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Think you can track him down? Getting a mark on him ought to be easy. Actually grabbing him? Another story entirely. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table, but catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. Huh. But there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. There it is. Data's all confidential. You just snap your fingers and it falls in your lap. I know where to look, and I know whose head to put in a vice. Also, hate wasting time, especially answering stupid questions. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Mm-hmm. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on it. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look. Their backup hustle will be on us. But right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor just outside the city and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess it's your lucky day. Dead zone. I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. Even tracking that AV will be a bitch. Familiar with the type. Saw legacy models flying around during the war. They're mammoth, but they're quick. Plus, they pack next-gen defenses. Can't take pot shots at it, not even with serious firepower. Just won't work. It's not about firepower. There are ways, and people who know them, or who can at least improvise on a theme. So a native? Know any hick mercs? Just one. Pan Am Palmer. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a true nomad. She knows those lands. And she will help you. Won't have a choice. Won't have a choice? Does not sound enticing. Not for her, not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Nab and Hellman. Your operation, your call. Got a bad feeling, V. Strange. The nomads give the city and city folk a wide berth. Varies by clan, by the connections they have, the depth of shit they're in. But you're right. Alda Caldos are rarely willing to do biz with the city. Pan Am's got a different take? Yep, on everything, it seems. Why's Pan Am gotta help me? 
I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, wasn't a good day for her. She ran into a hitch. Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the load back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. Guess I can try to help her, but if we don't know where to look, I mean... We do. I do. You know, but wouldn't tell Pan Am. Aim to play cat and mouse with me, too? My aim is to know an opportunity when I see one, and then to seize it. Say I told her everything. What do you think she'd have done? Grabbed her iron and gone on the warpath, that's what. Not hard to see how that could end it. And there's nothing I hate more than losing good people to plain stupidity. I'm her only chance, and she's my only chance. Two pawns on Rogue's board. You're quick. For a pawn. No fee. Fine, let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first. Sending you her deeds. Now, oh, finally. Let's get out of here. All clear. Thanks. Good luck. Good to see you. How's it going? <coughs> Gonna puke. Who would have thought? Did you know what you were talking about? Lana, do you hear me? Hey, Pan Am. Got your number from Rogue. Name's V. Great. Where's that old warhorse wanna kick me now? Forget Rogue for a minute. I wanna help you. Oh, very kind. But it's far too little, far too late. So do tell Rogue she can eat my shorts. Tell it to your therapist. Calling about your ride and the merch you lost. Interested? Or are you gonna tell me to eat your shorts too? The rail freight yard on Benita Street. The one hugging the city line. We'll meet there. See ya. Uh, saw more of those freaky murals. Did they start making sense? Tell any sort of story? Oh, just a bunch of tarot cards. <sighs> Pretty sure my brain's now beyond repair. The tarot tells the story of a fool's journey. Show me what you found. I'll tell you what's left. Here. Mm. You're still missing two arcana. Judgment and the devil. My guess is that they relate to a turning point in your life. One that's soon to arrive. What's this judgment about? One possible future. Of redemption, transition, awakening. The angel with the trumpet symbolizes the end of an era. And a call to rebirth. 
to a new beginning. Rather not run into the devil. Got a feeling he's bad vibes. That's the card of primal dormant desires, but also the will to survive. Hmm, doesn't sound so bad, actually. It also represents a false world, the trap these desires lay for you. What's up with the wandering fool? The fool is you and Silverhand. You've traveled a long road together, discovered your potential. Where are we headed? Your destination is the world, the final Arcanum. Both of you waged a war on the world. So there are two possibilities. Declare victory, or make peace. Could lose the war, too. Yes. Unfortunately, that's true. Thanks. Didn't get much out of that, but... Thanks. You'll understand when the time comes. I can't explain everything. All the tarot can tell me is that you will reach the world by one of four paths. Meaning? The final leg of the journey goes through the sun, the star, temperance, or the devil. Could just die, not even get that far. Oh, come on. You won't let that happen. Take this. It's all I can do to help. Good luck, V. On whatever road you choose. What are you... checking them out? You can recognize them by their cold, blue eyes. Creatures born centuries ago on the Antarctic... V, it's your lucky day. If you're serious about making headway in Pacifica, that is. You work some magic for me. As I said, whatever you're offering, the V-Boys could not, I quote, give a shit. You kept your receipt, I trust. Yet a counteroffer was forthcoming, a gig. Successful completion thereof could earn you an audience with Brigitte. Gig. Any hints on where it might be? Does it matter? Will it sway you? It's clear you don't intend to refuse. You'll learn all in due course. Besides, I didn't ask. Getting a word out of the voodoos is like pulling alligator teeth. Painful for everyone involved. Okay, so who do I contact next? Church, Sloan Lane, inside by the altar. They'll know to look for you. Got it. Thanks, Hans. Under masks of human skin, two-faced snakes, oppressors of humanity! You think President Myers is one of them? Why so many shootings? Why do countless die on the streets as the police do nothing? What human would condemn his brethren to such suffering? And why? And where did this filth slither out from, you ask? Antarctica. You said that already. Today they hide amidst the snow and ice of the South Pole. Step by step, usurping our crown as creation's chosen. Millions of years ago, they evolved from dinosaurs to become the world's first advanced, intelligent race. And who is their progenitor? Their masters? The scientists of Alpha Centauri! I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation so that I may continue my mission? You do good work. Use this to wake Night City up. Thank you for your devotion. I saw a disciple of truth in you from the very beginning. Radio waves bear the truth. Let those with ears listen and those with eyes behold. Their mothership conceals itself above our very heads. Ready yourself, for they are coming.
one for the soul. Pan Am? So you're V. Where's my car? Why does it matter? What's wrong with this one? It's borrowed. It's not mine. I asked where my car is. We can help each other. Rogue said so. I might have guessed. All right. Tell me all you know. Fail. And you can run back and tell Rogue to fuck right off. Hey, come on. Calm down. Don't tell me what to do. Fine. Know where to find the cargo and your car. But you go alone, you won't get him back. And you could lose something else besides. So let's figure something out. What do you want? Need to hit a Kangtao transport. Won't be easy. Want to know I can count on you. Are you out of your goddamned mind? About you or the job? Kang Tao's AV route will take it over Jackson Plains. Heard that should help us. Yeah, I doubt it. Gonna be a guy on board. Need to talk to him. Fuck. In return, info on your cargo. Help in getting back what's yours. We got a deal. I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? Thought this was mostly about the merch. Fuck the merch. With that ride, I can take any transport job in town. Without it, the only thing I can move is pizza. Maybe. Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirt-eating bastard. I will strangle you. Nash a chum of yours? He hang you out to dry? Do not call him that. Fine. Partner. Former. If ever. The shift tricked me. Straight and nipped my truck and the merch. Probably now aims to sell it off in Rocky Ridge. Is he ever going to be fucking disappointed? Rocky Ridge. Let's go. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Wanna tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's bag. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Buzz! Hey! 
Nash is gonna pass you the merch in Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Boss, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. Boss, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, Boz. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Boz. Vista Del Rey, Boz. Had no idea you drive for 6th Street. Is that not allowed? No, nothing wrong with it. They still wild about stars, stripes, and core heartland values. A strong word, wild. And I don't care. They pay well. It's simple. So, where to now? The Aldecaldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. Any chance they might help us in Rocky Ridge? That is the plan. Rogue mentioned your friends. Said you guys stopped seeing eye to eye. Well, since Rogue said so, it must be true. It isn't? You mean to irritate me. Okay, then. It was just a hiccup. They're still family. So it's complicated. You might say so, yes. Good, let's roll. Get in. Nice ride. Lots of space. Practical. Say no more. Please. How far is the camp? Just past the city line. We'll jump on the nine and head east. How the hell did you land in this mess? I liked the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamned fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. And I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue, do better not to worry what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch. Rogue's queen of the afterlife. Plays her pawns as she pleases. Did you just call me a pawn? I got a good look at her. She rose to the top because she reads people. So what if she keeps things to herself? It's a skill in her profession. Well, I think she's a lying, manipulative bitch. She put me together with that Raffin. Did you know that? Wait, Nash is Raffin? Yes. He runs with the Wraiths, the largest Raffin group in the area. You know about them, right? Mm-hmm. Nomads tossed out of clans. Yes, mostly. Nomads don't banish their own without a reason. So think murderers, rapists, freaks. They gather in teams, sometimes form actual gangs. Most of them are wanted and have warrants on their heads. Shit. And that bitch had me working with scum like that. Must have had her reasons. You don't say. Rogue won't open her mouth without weighing the for and against. What to spill and what to withhold.
We're almost there. We'll gather my guys, then ride to Rocky Ridge. Look what the cat dragged in. Is that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Fuck you too. Mm hmm. And who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. Well, might not have needed a babysitter if you hadn't lost the merch in the car. Shut it, V. <laughs> Are you kidding? Did that beauty Thornton of yours finally bite it? She rode it to death in Old Night City. No, it got clipped. Shit. Who dared? It doesn't matter. I'll get her back. That's why I'm here. Need your help. With what? What's this about? Raffin screwed Pan Am. Plan is to show him that was a bad idea. How bad did they get you? Bad enough to make me sit quietly through all your bullshit. You know, we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Now's hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? Really could use your help. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Pan Am. This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance. But... But Saul never said a thing about gear. Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear, then be out of your hair. Looks like you're stuck with me. Mm-hmm. You disappointed? I don't know. Maybe a little, yes. Hey, Pan Am. Are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again soon. We'll talk next time. Hey, Pan Am. Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not your concern, friend. Will you help me with this? What's inside? A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. All right, that's everything. Let's go. Figure out your differences with Saul. Will you come back? Pan Am, you'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. So. I'm off. Yeah, yeah, go on, go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Put it in the trunk. We can go. Hop in. Seems you got a real problem with authority. What? Rogue? Saul? Your leader? Their leader. Seemed in a hurry to delta the hell out of there. Let's just say Saul wouldn't have been happy to see me. What happened? The reason we came to California was because he promised change for the Aldecaldos. 
He claimed we would turn over a new leaf. But you saw it. We got a handful of tents on a heap of sand. A hell of a promised land. I wanted something different. Better. Saul's a damned coward. He'll be the end of the clan, I'm certain. Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. I'd stay in the camp too if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. But I'm not part of it anymore. Still treated you like you're one of them. They care about you. Mm-hmm. Do you have anyone you would call close? Not right now, no. Could just be a matter of time, though. <laughs> okay. Were those two in the army? Scorp and Mitch? Yeah. Panzer boys. They were on contract during the last war. Panzer boys? Flew those huge transporters? Scorpion piloted. Mitch ran security. They both got some kick-ass combat implants and a stack of really fucked up nightmares. So, Rocky Ridge. Empty, dusty hole in the middle of bumfuck nowhere, I heard. Natives either moved to Night City or just got the hell out. Then you know almost all there is to know. The whole area was waiting on a new interstate extension. It was supposed to breathe new life into the town. It didn't happen, of course. How many ghost towns do you think are there? Hundreds? Countrywide? Thousands. I drove down I-80 the other day. All you have to do is pull over after sundown. It's quiet then. And you hear it. What's that? The wind whistling through boarded up windows. Tumbleweeds scratching across dry, sandy tracks. That's how towns die. Not with a bang, but with whispers and whimpers. Okay, we have arrived. What do we do? We get ready to greet the Raffins, and we've little time for that. We'll need to improvise. We should scout first, to look for anything that might be useful. Now Rocky Ridge could be any debtor. Everything's down, nothing works here. Well, have you found anything? No dice. Nothing's up, all cut off. Well, we'll make it work. The Raffins will roll in after dusk. We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. Let's check the substation. Okay. But there's no juice on them! Not to worry! Come down! I know how to surprise the bastards! Right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switchgear on the roof. 
We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. Understood? Think flipping on the lights at the intersection will give us the upper hand? Really? First, we don't know how many are coming. My thinking is it'll be a sizable crew. Second, we have to create an opening to get to my car. If they're bunched together, we won't stand a chance. So we give them a little light show at the intersection? Yes. We'll breathe some life into this dusty old town. Soon as they see the lights, they'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First we start up the control terminal below. The gear on the roof is a hunk of junk without it. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That should do the trick. Wait for me by the substation. I'll bring the car around. The panel looks to be in good shape. I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and running. Grab the jumper cables from the trunk. We'll boost it from the car battery. Cable connected. Give me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. And done. Now the Black Rattler. There she goes. Thought the old jalopy served us well. Okay, I've got voltage. Start the terminal inside. And once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. You got it. I'll set up on the tower. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. You flip the breakers when I give you the signal to do so, understood? Yes, ma'am. Switch gears got power. Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get into position. We wait. Remember, as soon as we see them, you give us power. Raffins will come from where? Any idea? The northeast, I wager. From the freeway that was never finished. Got it. Cover me, just in case. Of course. They're rolling in. In my thorn. You see her? Really, really hard to miss. Let's take them by surprise. Let's try to do this quietly. If anything happens, I'll start picking them up. Sound good? Sounds great. Where's this son of a bitch, Buzz? You, wait for him here. Get good and ready. The show starts now. 
Let there be light. Take the wheel. Sure, sure. Need to drive into the pros. Dreamy indeed. No surprise you wanted her back. She completes me. See? Managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion. Listen, V, it's not over yet. It's not? You got the cargo, you got your car. I did not get Nash, who was not in Rocky Ridge. The fucker didn't show. So it was about vengeance. The whole time. The hell you know about me? Either you're not being straight with me, or you don't know what you want. Hard to say which is Just worse. listen to me, for fuck's sake! I know where their little hidey hole is. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. Ugh, all right. So where's this hideout? A hop and skip away. Thanks, V. What Nash did. I placed my trust in him. He was the first person I worked with after leaving the Alda Caldos. After I came to Night City. And I granted him my trust. I get it. Now how you feel. Had someone betray me just like that once. And did you make them pay? Never got the chance. Someone else got to him first. But if they had it, would you have done it? No doubt. Without skipping a beat. Let's get this over with. Are you ready? 
Let's get him.
Hello, Rogue. Pan Am. What did you say again? Solve your own problems? Clean up your shit? Nash is dead. One shit cleaned. Happy? And the Sixth Street merch? Nash can't deliver it anymore. But if you ask nicely, I might be able to help you. Help me? I take my cut up front, honey. But I guess I'm touched. Was actually wondering if you wouldn't forget about Biz while you were out chasing down a vendetta. Fuck! So, feel any better? Maybe a little. Let's get out of here. What bitter cold bitch that rogue. Think she might have lost the plot. Mean to say she used to be sweet and alluring? Huh. <laughs> Never that. But she's no stranger to the other end of the stick. Think she might need a nice strong shock. Hey boss. Got your cargo. No, no fast ones. Come on, let's meet. Sunset Motel. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Okay, I arranged our meeting. Let's do the deal and start working on Hellman. Agreed? Sunset Motel? What's that? A safe spot. It's not far from here. Sixth Street not likely to pull anything? I've driven for them before. Never had them do anything strange. I'm hoping they know what's good for business. Should be fun. They're here. Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? No. At least I don't think so. Hey, boss. Panna! How's Nash? Didn't seem to be answering his phone. Don't call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got balls, girl. What's this? A bonus of some sort? We work together. Hmm. Change tunes like you change clothes, girl. There. First class merch. Mm hmm. Everything's in order? Check your account. Should be pretty plush in a couple minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. Think you earned a tip. Let's roll. That went well. Come on. Let's get a drink. Raffin's wiped, Sixth Street's pleased. Pretty good day for Pan Am Palmer. But day's not over yet. You still have a chance to piss me off. Hello, Noah. Hey. New biz or new friends back there? Take a wild guess. Is everything good with you? Do those bozos come around again? Raffins? Nah, it's been quiet. They'll be back, sure enough. This place has seen worse. What can I get you? Brosif. Two of them. So that package for Street, what was it? You didn't peek? 
Valoperidol. Drugs for the cyber psychos in our midst. They trading them? Yes. They have deals. With black clinics, rippers. Cheers. Here's to what's yet to come. To what's to come. Soya Silva cheeked the door. An explosion of taste. Another one over here. Don't make trouble. Be in trouble. Thanks, Noah. Cheers. Let me know if you need anything else. The Raffins. We done with them? Oh no. The shiver cockroaches. One's never rid of them. But it should be quiet for a time. They'll need to gather their wits and dust themselves off. The Alta Caldos. Think you'll ever go back? I mean, not right now, but... Someday. I don't rightly know. On the one hand, I don't have anyone outside the clan. Shit, I don't really know any other life. But on the other? Without my clan, who am I? What would I become if I stayed in Night City? Could always try it out. See who you become in Night City. Except, City doesn't always play fair. Don't know if it's worth sacrificing your friends along the way. You mean Mitch? Scorpion? Come on. Sooner or later, Pan Am, the city will suck you in. Won't need to cut whatever ties you got left to the Aldecaldos. The city will do that for you. I guess I should think about it. All right. Time we look to my needs. What's the plan for Hellman? I've come up with a plan. A first draft. But I need to sleep on it. Work it out. Then we can talk about the details. I think it best to rent rooms here. Just to stay in the area. We'll get to work around midnight. It'll help keep us out of sight. Agreed? Maybe only one room? Mm-hmm. Noah has two twin beds in every room. We'll save some money. Not quite what I had in mind. I know. Just glad to have met you, so I thought... Don't worry about it. I'm glad we met, too. That was a damned tough day. But still, we pulled through. And we'll do it again tomorrow. I like to hear that. Are we all right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, I will need a room. Twin beds. Just for tonight. I'll go catch a few winks. Good night. Mm-hmm.